You know, I was just saying earlier, I think I've got a big, like, man crush on Trier. Oh, yeah? It's something about his voice. I think he's, uh, I think he really encapsulates, you know, Melee's target demographic. And yeah, with smooth, smooth voices. Smooth voices. Catch Trier on, Trier on, on commentary. I don't know if he, he makes it up most times, because most times he's pretty bu busy in brackets, so. That's good for him. Yeah. He's... One of the best Sopos I've ever seen. Easily the best one I've ever played. And uh, unfortunately, he, he did his Sopo just got eliminated. But Well, I mean, listen, it's still a pretty even game. He's got to take a stock here, but he's... He, uh, he is, has the game lead yep. as well. Uh, but it'll be hard because, well, maybe not. But yeah. once Fox gets a lead, he can uh, choose to play much more. Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah. One yeah. thing about Trier, though, is he his scrapping ability is crazy. If you aren't ready for you, he's going to come at you like a truck. Watch this. Yeah, let's see if he can get 
back this He can just be here. everywhere. And of course, the... Uh, I don't know the rules about whether or not wobbling is legal. I'm going to assume I don't not think here. wobbling... Yeah, I don't think wobbling is legal. But if Spark, the Spark and Mine can get a... Uh, ice Climbers can get chain grabs as long as they are close to the... Uh, as long as they are close to the edge of the stage. Mm -hmm. Here's the thing. Trier, I've seen him turn one grab into a kill. Exactly. So even without wobbling, he's, his grab is still a threat. Also, incredibly good at, you know, keeping Nana uh, alive. Yeah, that's certainly one of the things that uh, Ice Climbers, for me, I can't keep track of. I mean, even playing against them sometimes, yeah. too, I suppose, as well. Keeping track of the, You have twice right. as many characters to play with. All right, let's see how that Sopo can do. I'll be out in two. We'll see if it's two. Yeah. I, Spark and Med, though, has been... Uh, Playing pretty good around, you know. Oh, right, well, he we takes, a game three. takes a game. All right. Game three. Uh, Spark, I think, uh, was doing a little bit better there towards the end of the match, kind of keeping uh, out of Trier's kind of threat. Yeah, again, once you have the lead, at, especially as the faster character, you can really choose to slow down the pace and make the, make the Ice Climbers work for for every opening. Yeah. They don't get that, that big grab that Ice Climbers can convert like, on. See, like this one. Here's the handoff, but he wasn't close to the edge. So if you're not close to the edge, then you mm. can't have that uh, kind of almost yeah. an infinite grab into a eventual smash attack for the kill. One thing is, Trie is really good at getting kind of stray grabs, letting them get into percent, like, like I said. He really only needs two or three openings of stock, from what I've seen. Uh, but those openings are a little harder just with ICs. Yeah, certainly. Yeah, ICs are one of among the the very grab-based characters. Yeah. A lot, of, a lot of characters you can get away. I know Mango was known for a, for a long time uh, of being a like, not against grab, but not known for his grabs mm. much at all. But Ice climbers, especially with or without wobbling, there's no way around having a really grab and centralized mm -hmm. gameplay. Right, also, a very good stage for Trie here. Yeah. We've got the Sopo out again. Yeah. So, what do you think about how, how Sparks playing? I think he's doing a good job, like we saw last game. He seems to be able to. They really address both of the Ice Climbers equally when they get split up. He seems mm -hmm. to, to favor Nana. Um, but he hasn't had the lead this game, so he is not able to slow things down. Yeah. This is, right now, this is his game to lose. And, you know, I think Trie keeps going like this. Uh, you know, especially on this stage, it seems likely he can, you know, clinch out another game. Yeah. Uh, and this but, is a three out of five as well. Ooh, okay. yeah. So yeah, it's best three out of got at best least out of five. one more game after yeah. this, but we'll see if it goes to game five. Okay, the Sopo is out again. Shows yeah. you a little bit about how, a little bit of a oh, it was, uh, defensive play. Because mm -hmm. if you're not careful, then then it's it's way easy to to lose both climbers instead of just yeah. Running shot. Yeah. The down smash from the uh, the ice climbers is certainly a good get off. Mm -hmm. And one thing I'll say about you know Trie is he's really good at. I feel like I say this quite a lot when I'm on comms, but uh, he's a, car a player who, when you make mistakes, will punish you really hard for them. Okay. And he is you know he's got a lot of practice against fast characters, keeping them off of them. Like right. I said. Tree uh, is up uh, two to one. Yeah. All right, I'm going to head out um, okay. really quick, but uh, I may or may not you be back. Take your time. Yeah. I think I will stay on here and uh, speak with the people. We have a cough button. Everyone, I hope you're doing well tonight. This is game uh, game three, or game four, uh, for Trier versus Spartan Mind. Are you hopping on here? What's up, Johnny Lawrence, back on commentary. Uh, 
for the winners' finals, actually. Mid set, mid set switch up here. Yeah, the stakes are high for winners' winners' finals. Yeah, right now Trier up two one. How uh, did Trier get in this place? Um, I think he went. He lost. Uh, I think it was game two. So it's been a little bit of a trading back and forth. Uh, but he did just win the previous game on final destination. And looks like he... Sparking, man, kind of frustrated so yeah, far. Yeah, you know, it, it's hard not to sometimes when you, when you SD, but yeah. he gets the stock back. It's oh, I know what, I know what it's two. like, though. He's still... This is still Trier's game right now. Two stocks don't want. Trier's playing yeah. confident, and Sparking, man, starting game, to... Trier's match to lose. Yeah, making some there mistakes. The one thing is about Sparking, man, though, is uh, Sparking, man, the type of player who, you know, sometimes for different players, it, it works out differently. Uh, in terms of like what gets them going, Spark and Mad like getting a, a little pissed off actually helps him out. Oh, yeah. So Spark and Mad, uh, yeah, he's he's the left and the left and Yeah, kind of like uh, yeah. The anger fuels you. Yeah, I mean not really, it, not even. It's just like uh, it's more almost manga like, uh, being like a dual main too. Yeah. Uh, where it's like, it's not like mad in terms of like left and mad, but it's it's like mad in terms of like, uh, just like. Man, I don't want to lose to such and such yeah, well, like a, I, I an option. I see Leffen as a yeah. more of in in game mad player. Yeah, Mango is more after tournaments, in between things. Oh, it's more it's more what fuels him. He play he plays cool, uh, but then it's like Mango said this himself. He was like, uh, like several times where he's just like, he imagines his opponent oh, like Sparkle winning, it back. and that's what helps him out. Yeah. It, like Sparkle Man's kind of like a certain like, yeah, you do a certain thing. Uh, that that sort of mentality where it's just like, okay, I don't want this to happen. It's like willing. It's being mad at just things in general. It's like ah things versus like being mad specific. Being like uh, like motivated, that, that motivated mad. Like it's pissed me off. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, this stock count. Uh, it looked like Spark and Mind was was really bringing it back, but but looks yeah. Unfortunately, like that is the game. The thing is, Trie is Trie with the win. Trie is so solid as a player. Yeah. And he's unfazed. To to, he, just, to he plays the game. Did you say that's winners finals or semifinals? What's up? That was that, uh, that was winners that finals. Was winners finals. Oh, okay, yeah. so it looks like Trie will be in grands. Trie being grands and hopefully finally win a. Xanadu. It's been a little while for uh, for Trie uh, in terms of his Xanadu wins. He's gotten a lot of second places very okay, recently. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, you know, we just had Big House last week, and yeah. I know that there were there were some players, uh, some notably, uh, well, notably players yeah. who would be often here at Xanadu, like uh, a like Junebug and uh, Malachi. Well, Junebug doesn't really come anymore. It's I guess that's RBA. true. It's, yeah. it's a special event, but um. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it's a really good opportunity for uh, Tria to, to hold this down and bring home.